Hello everybody and welcome back to the GBW YouTube channel and in today's video we're going to be doing a match attacks battle between the booster tins and the mega tins to see which ones come out on top. So if you're excited to see what tins are better, the booster or the megas, make sure to absolutely smash that like button and if you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button because that way you will never miss a future upload just like this one. So yeah, without further ado, let's open up all four booster tins and all four mega tins and see which one's better. So yes, of course, we have already opened all four booster tins and all four mega tins on the channel already, but I thought I'd switch it up a bit. Let's do it again, but a little battle in between. And we'll be starting off with booster tin number one, then going to mega tin number one, then booster tin two, mega tin two, and so on. Uh, so yeah, booster tins, they contain the exclusive Artist of the Game limited edition cards, probably my favourite cards in the whole Match Attacks collection. As well as that, there are 42 cards inside. Inside these tins, you can, of course, find the real autograph cards, the Black Edge editions, energy cards, shields, all that good stuff. And it's the same, of course, with the Mega Tins as well. Uh, and these retail for £9.99. The Booster Tins and the Mega Tins are £5 more expensive at £14.99. Without further ado, let's start off with our first uh, tin of the video, Booster Tin number one. And let's see what we can get in here. Can we get a nice Relic card today as well? That is another thing we're potentially chasing. Uh, inside the uh, Booster Tins, you can get the Centurion Relic Relic cards inside Lucky Tins, and of course Stadium Stars, the boot Mega Tins, you can get, as well as the Centurion Relics, Match Worn Shirt cards. So, let's see what we can get in tin number one, and we're starting off with the beautiful Artist of the Game Limited Edition of Ronaldinho. It is beautiful. Look at that. Ronaldinho, Artist of the Game Limited Edition, guaranteed inside every single booster tin number one, as well as Jamal Musiala. So you get a past and present limited edition inside. And then, of course, we've got a code card there. There we go. Feel free to scan that. And you get a load of base cards to add to your collection. We've obviously seen these cards numerous times on the channel before. And, of course, most of them are upside down as I was just going through them. Uh, we've got Memphis Depay there, Ruiz, Muller, Makoko, Mario, Silva, Mkhitaryan, and Hernandez. Fernandez Marino, uh, we've got McCrory F for Rangers, Gitruda, Sal, and then we've got our insert cards, we've got the Juve badge, uh, Radetzky captain, the Celtic badge, playmaker Modric, uh, finisher allegedly, Gabriel Jesus, uh, guardian Jan Oblak, uh, Schlotterbeck eliminator, and a hundred club of Martin Erdegaard, there we go, that's a nice start, always good to get a hundred club in one of these tins, I think that's the bare minimum you should be getting for a booster tin, it has to be said, so it's good we have started off one with uh, uh, started off with one right there in Martin Odegaard. Uh, then got a Crystal Parallel of Munio. Then got Pedri Crystal. We've got Legendary Moment Stevie G. Uh, Man of the Match, Jan Oblak by Shetit Next Gen. And Otavio Tops Heritage card at the back there for Porto. Uh, so yeah, there we go. Two Crystal Parallels, 100 Club. Pretty decent start, have to, has to be said. And, of course, the exclusive Artist of the Game cards as well. Uh, so put the Erdegaard up on a stand because that's the rarest hit so far from the Booster Tins. And let's get stuck inside our first uh, Mega Tin of the video, Mega Tin Stadium Stars number 1, which does contain these four uh, Stadium Star Limited Edition cards. And, fingers crossed, we can hit a Relic because we've been pretty unlucky when it comes to Relic cards this year. So let's open it up. And have we got a third? No, we haven't got a fourth pack of cards. Not a third one, because you always get a third pack of cards. Uh, so, yeah, no uh, a relic in this tin, sadly. So, yeah, here we go. Here are the stadium stars from the first mega tin. Here we go. So, we've got Liao, uh, Donnarumma, Vinicius Jr., and Jack Grealish. These four are guaranteed inside every single uh, mega tin number one you purchase. Right, let's get inside our first pack of big cards. And it looks like, by the way... We might have a cheeky little shield card in there, which is very, very nice. It could well be numbered, remember. And then, of course, there is the chance of hitting a real autograph card as well. So we'll skip past these base cards again. We've seen these numerous times before on the channel. We have done a 12 Megatin opening on the channel as well, where we didn't, um, we unfortunately didn't find a relic, but uh, we did go through 12 Megatin. So if you want to see that, check that out on the top right of your screen now. And here we go. It's time to 
have a look at our Pro Elite Shield. It's Barcelona. It's Ronald Araujo. It's not a numbered one, but there we go. Ronald Araujo, Pro Elite Chrome Shield card. There we go. Fantastic. Good start for the Mega Tins, it has to be said. Uh, obviously, $14.99 each. We've then got the Dortmund badge. We've got a Crystal Parallel of Radetzky. We've then got Angelo Ogbonna, Gavi Battler, uh, Delict Guardian. We've then got Oliver Kahn moment, uh, Hartman, uh, Man of the Match, Taremi, and Quentin Timber. Uh, Tops Heritage at the back there. There we go. So not a bad start indeed with a cheeky little pro elite shield of Ronald Araujo from Megatin number one. But remember, we do still have another pack of cards to open inside this tin. That is why, for just an extra fiver, it's probably worth going for a Mega Tin over a Booster Tin. But you do need those Booster Tins for the best looking cards in the collection, the artist of the game. So here we go. Here's our base cards in the second pack of cards from Mega Tin number one. Uh, so yeah, pause the screen if you see a card you want to have a closer look at. And uh, yeah, so we've got a Pepe Captain there. We've then got Greg Taylor Crystal, uh, Virgil van Dijk Eliminator, Casemiro Battler, Skriniar Eliminator, Declan Rice Man of the Match, Gattuso Cult Hero, Man of the Match of Ramos, uh, Lenormand, Tops Heritage, and oh wow, this Megatin has been sensational. Erling Haaland, unbeatable, 101-101, wow. What a tin that is with a pro elite of Ronald Araujo and a hundred club of Harlem. That is again mega tins. They are sensational. They really are. $14.99 each, and you're getting a hundred club. Obviously, not guaranteed, but you do get your guaranteed limited edition cards of the stadium stars. But then, of course, you've got a pro elite shield in there as well. That is a very, very nice start indeed. Right, let's put those both on card stands now. And that is a great start for the Megatins. They're definitely winning so far. But again, we've got to remember, they're an extra five or each. Right, let's get into booster tin number two and see what we can get inside this one. Have we got a relic card hiding in here? Oh, no, it doesn't look like it. That's unfortunate. But there's still every chance we can find a real autograph card, which I still haven't done since Match Attacks 101 back in 2021. That's a lot of ones there, isn't there? It's been a while. So we're starting off this one with the artist of the game, Zidane. Beautiful card and Rafael Liao. Look at that. He's got a lot of cards in this collection, hasn't he? And uh, then we've got a free digital code. And then we've got an absolute ton of match attacks base cards. Of course, essential to completing your collection, having all these base cards. Uh, so yeah, let's skip past those. And then we start off with the Arsenal badge as our first insert card. Then got Bonucci captain, the Man United badge. Uh, we've got Battler, Declan Rice. We've got Jimenez Eliminator, Cobble. Uh, we've got uh, Battler, Rodri. Oh, there we go. Another 100 clubs. So we're two for two when it comes to the 100 clubs in these tins. And it's Alessandro Bastoni this time for Inter Milan. We've then got Rafael Varane, Crystal Parallel, Next Gen, Schlederup, uh, Next Gen of Jacob Ramsey, Man of the Match, De Bruyne, Cult Hero, Yaya Torre, and a Heritage of Radetzky there. Uh, there we go. So that is decent. 200 clubs found from the two booster tins open so far. No sign of any real autograph cards yet. But, I mean, it's so, so rare. I can't remember the exact odds on finding one, but it'll be very unlikely if we do. Right, let's get into Megatin number two. Stadium Stars Megatin two, that is. And you get inside here four new exclusive Stadium Stars limited edition cards. And there's a chance of hitting a relic. And it's not going to happen, I'm afraid. That is incredibly upsetting. Right, we'll get into the uh, limited edition pack first and have a little closer look at those. So we've got a Manuel Neuer. There we go. I love the Allianz Arena in the background. What an iconic stadium. Uh, they've got Martin Odegaard there, Dusan Tadic, and Marco Royce. Uh, these four are guaranteed inside every single uh, uh, Mega Tin number two you buy. And then we've got our two packs of cards. Fingers crossed we can get another successful tin. And I'll tell you what... That is another shield card in there. We are doing very well with shield cards, it has to be said, from these Mega Tins. Uh, so let's skip past these base cards and get straight to that incredible shield. Let's see which one it's going to be. Is it going to be hiding behind here? Yes, it is. It's Real Madrid. There we go. Tony Cruz. Is that SH number? So SH number 8. That is beautiful. Pro Elite, midfielder, Tony Cruz, Real Madrid. We have got an El Clasico of shields from uh, the Megatins so far. We're two from 
two now, which is absolutely sensational. Look at that. Uh, so that's another shield card to add to our roster. Uh, and we've still got another pack of cards to open as well. And then we've got Calabria, Captain, Serge Nabry, Playmaker De Bruyne, Battle of Bruno, uh, Vinicius Junior, Finisher, Schlidrup, Next Gen, uh, Felipe Anderson, Man of the Match, Balde. And then we finish with Quentin Timber, Tops Heritage there uh, for Feyenoord. Right, another pack of cards to open. Can we get another Pro Elite Shield? That would be sensational. Or, of course, the Energy cards and the Black Edge Editions. You haven't seen any of them so far. Uh, so skip past these base cards. I uh, don't think the autos will be hiding in amongst these, but if they are, then uh, I've got to be careful. Uh, we've then got the Newcastle badge. We've got Vitinha Crystal Parallel. I see a hundred club. We then got a Guardian Ramsdale, Morata finisher, Battle of Ozcham. We then got Colt Hero Ravanelli, Man of the Match Pavlo. Uh, Pavlo, <laughs> you can tell I'm hungry. I've just said <laughs> Man of the Match Pavlova. Isn't that some sort of dessert? Isn't it? Uh, we then got legendary moment of Patrick Cliver. Uh, we've also got Lenormand Heritage and a Nicolo Barella 100 Club uh, to wrap up uh, Megatin number two. There we go. So 200 clubs and two shields from the Megatin so far. That's to be expected. But I tell you what, the booster tins are doing well. Two from two when it comes to 100 clubs. As I said, that's probably the bare minimum you expe you'd expect from spending £9.99 on one of these bad boys. Uh, but now it's time to open up uh, booster tin number three and see what artists of the game limited editions we've got in here. Potentially an autograph card and potentially a relic. Doesn't look like we're going to get a relic, sadly. But you never know. There could be an auto hiding inside. Right, here we go. Let's see how successful Booster Tin number three is. Uh, we're starting off with the artist of the game, R9. <laughs> it's just so nice. I love having legend cards in match attacks. And then we've got uh, Kevin De Bruyne, artist of the game there as well. We've then got a Alex Grimaldo base card at the front there for uh, Leverkusen. Obviously, former uh, former Benfica player, isn't he? I can't remember who else he used to play for. Uh, but let's skip past these base cards, see if there's anything of note en route. Doesn't look like it. Uh, we then got the West Ham badge, Immobile captain, Barcelona's badge, and he said Bayern Munich there. Uh, Guardian Wambasaka, Neymar playmaker, Pablo Fornals to Stegen. Oh, hello! That's the first one of those we've seen today. Neymar Jr. Black Edge Edition for uh, PSG, and then he said Barcelona. Uh, of course, former Barcelona player Neymar, obviously now playing in the Saudi league. Um, but yeah, there we go. Neymar Jr. Black Edge Edition. That is another successful booster tin. It has to be said when you get hits like this and the 100 clubs and the shields you can't argue with the price great value for money has to be said so yeah we'll put that on the stand in a minute we've then got Corne crystal parallel valverde man of the match uh duranville next gem we've then got steven gerrard legendary moment yan or black bike signature and then we have got uzman dembele tops heritage now of psg Right, let's get a little card stand out for Neymar Jr. Black Edge Edition. And that is another uh, successful booster tin. It has to be said. Three tins opened, 200 clubs and a Black Edge Edition. Now it's time to see if Megatin number three can deliver yet again another Pro Elite Shield. That would be sensational, but it, it's, it's going to be quite rare. But let's see if we can get something of note in here. Potentially a Relic. Doesn't like it, sadly. Oh, I can't believe I haven't found a single relic this year. And oh, no, did I? No, I found. I think I found one of the Centurion relic cards uh, in the booster tins. But apart from that, nothing in. However many mega tins I've opened, I've been pretty unlucky. It has to be said. No sign of autograph cards either, which is obviously very upsetting. So yeah, let's open up this pack of cards here, and we're starting off with Gavi, and then got Rashford, Werner, uh, obviously now Spurs by the way, and uh, Musiala Stadium Start Limited Edition cards. Fantastic, guaranteed inside every single mega tin number three you purchase in your local shop. Or, of course, at Tops' web website, uk.tops.com. Uh, so, yeah, here we go. First pack of cards. Doesn't look like we've got a shield card in here. By the way, Fabio Carvalho, now at Hull City. Uh, it's a bit of a fall from grace from RB Leipzig, but that loan move clearly didn't work out. Uh, so, fingers crossed for him that he does well at Hull City in the uh, best league in the world, the EFL Championship. Uh, so, yeah, we've got uh, Atletico Madrid's badge. We've then got Pedro Conchalves, uh, Crystal Parallel, Playmaker Miggy Almiron. Uh, we've then got Luka Modric, Playmaker. Maker, Jesus finisher allegedly. We then got Cole Hero Ravanelli. Pavlovich, not Pavlova. <laughs> Man of the match there. We then got Patrick Cliver. Uh, Dedic, uh, Tops Heritage. And it's another 100 club. This time, Bastoni. So we're holding up hopes for this second pack of cards here. Because otherwise, if you're opening a Megatin and you only get 100 club, 
you're not happy. You're not going to be happy because you've paid £14.99. Uh, so, yeah, I've actually run out of card stands. This is a first. How the devil has that happened? Right, we'll just have to put him with uh, with Barella there at the back. That works. Um, but, yeah, let's get into this next pack of, uh, pack of cards. At least, at the bare minimum here, we need to see another 100 club. Anything less than that, and this tin has been an L. So we'll skip past these base cards. Hopefully an auto is not hiding in amongst these because that would be... Uh, Pretty pretty crazy, I have to say. You'd think they'd put them in an individual pack of cards, but anyway, that's that done. We then got Oyathabal, Captain, Mahari Maguire, Captain Crystal Parallel, uh, Guardian of Black, Schlotterbeck Eliminator, Harlan Finisher, Next Gen Schledder Up, again, honestly, every single tin I open. And then got uh, Felipe Anderson, Man of the Match, Balde Next Gen, and Borgia Iglesias, Tops Heritage. Wow, that was a stinky, stinky, stinky Megatin. Megatin number three, very, very poor. Right, time for the final round then, and um, let's see what Booster Tin number four has to uh, has to offer us. Could he give us a Relic card? Let's find out by uh, struggling to open it up. Ooh, chance. Oh, we have got a cheeky little Relic card, Centurion Relic inbound. Woohoo! Right, come on. That's good. That is good. We love to see that. A cheeky little relic card. The booster tins, I'll tell you what, they, they've really performed on the big occasion. It's a Bayern Munich forward. It's going to be Harry Kane, isn't it? No, has Harry Kane paid 100 games in the Champions League? It's, probably, it's either... No, it's going to be Thomas Muller. Surely. Thomas Muller? It is Thomas Muller. Centurion card. Look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. 100 plus apps. Oh, Wow, that is a sensational card. Or even though it's absolutely battered in the bottom uh, bottom left corner there, um, that is still very very cool. Thomas Muller Centurion, as it says on the back there, Bayern Munich forward. So um, yeah, nice one, cool little relic card, nice little addition into match tax this year or the last couple of years actually. And um, yeah, I'll tell you what, the uh, booster tins have done pretty well, all things considered. Getting one of these, I can't remember how rare they are. I think it's one in sixteen, perhaps. Centurion relic cards one. 28 booster tins autographs one in 542 it's never gonna happen is it it is never ever gonna happen but we've smashed the odds there we've opened four uh, in fact our luck when it comes to the booster tin relics has been absolutely sensational when you think about it considering how many more mega tins you've opened and we've had no relics at all this season we've done very well with uh, this year's centurion relics hitting two now I think both for Bayern Munich as well. I think we have Thomas Muller and Neuer. So yeah, we've got Artists of the Game, Nedved, and a Artists of the Game, Bruno Fernandes in this one. Then we've got a Code card. Feel free to use that. And then we've got a heck of a lot of base cards to add into your Match Attacks albums or binders, whatever you want to call it. Let's skip past them, though, and see what we've got lurking at the back. We've got the PSG badge, Ruben Diaz, Captain, Guardian, Nick Pope. We've then got Rudiger, Eliminator, Rice, Battler, Jimenez, Eliminator, 100 Club, Rodri. Now, this has been a very, very, very good booster tin. It has to be said. And I'll tell you what, they're catching up. That's 300 clubs. They've now matched the mega tins. Obviously, mega tins have one tin to spare. But I'll tell you what, the booster tins, for being £5 cheaper, we've got a relic card, a black edge edition, and 300 clubs from all four. That's not bad going at all, would you say? I'm quite content with that. And a Rodri is a pretty decent one to get as well. Uh, we've then got uh, Nuno Mendes, Crystal Parallel, Lima Crystal, uh, Alfonso Day, Davies, Man of the Match, Sheshko, Next Gen, Ronaldinho, and Lenormand, Tops Heritage. And that wraps up the booster tins. Now it's time for the final tin of the video, the Stadium Stars Mega Tin number four. And let's see what we're going to get in this one. We need to see a nice relic card or a genuine auto. It's going to be no relic again. Wow. Wow. Uh, how many? Honestly, can someone count up how many of the Megatins have opened now without a Relic card this season? Very, very unlucky, it has to be said. But let's see what's in these pack of cards with our limited editions in. And uh, yes, yeah, so we've got the code card. We've then got Verratti, Kimmich, Bruno Guimaraes, and Nicolo Barella Stadium Stars there. And let's open up the two packs of cards. We need to see another Pro Elite Shield, uh, an energy card. That's something we haven't seen at all today. Um, but so far, I have to say, value for money, the booster tins win. So yeah, let's skip past these base cards. If there's anything of note, please uh, feel free to pause the screen. Have a look at your favourite player on the card. Oh, I spy an energy card. There we go. That is what we needed to see. And it is a beauty as well. Robert Lewandowski energy card for Barcelona. That is a stunner. 
There we go. Energy Robert Lewandowski. Nice little hit there for Barcelona. And um, yeah, I have to say, the Mega Tins have done well. The Booster Tins have done well. Other than, uh, obviously, Mega Tin number three, it, it's been a successful opening. And they've got Gulacci Captain. We've also got Trossard, Crystal Parallel, Playmaker Adiemi, Guardian Edison, Playmaker Almiron, uh, Next Gen Kivior, Man of the Match Pedri, Carragher Cult Hero, and a Neymar Tops Heritage, one of his many cards in this collection, even though he doesn't play for the team anymore. Uh, so yeah, let's open up the last pack of cards of the video, see if we can get one more 100 club for good measure, or, even better... Another shield. Well, okay, Megatin number four wins. Megatin's win full stop. It has to be said. That has truly made up for Megatin number three. That is absolutely incredible. We've got another shield. That's three shields from four tins. That is absolutely bonkers. And it is going to be Lukas Sukic for uh, uh, FC Salzburg. Look at that. That's one we need for the collection as well. Then that deserves a smashing of the like button. So please do that. Um, but yeah, there we go. Lukas Sukic, midfielder, pro elite. Third pro elite shield of the video. All in the Megatins. That is bonkers. Uh, we then got Captain Marco Royce. We've got the West Ham Crystal. Guardian Cobble. Uh, Battle of Rodri. Sven Botman Eliminator. Callum Wilson, Man of the Match. Uh, Robert Perez, Cult Hero. Man of the Match, Salah. And we finish with Tony Cruz. Top Terrages there for Real Madrid. Well, there we go, ladies and gents. Let us know down in the comment section what do you think is better, the booster tins or the mega tins from Match Attacks 2023-2024. And, of course, while you're down there, make sure to absolutely smash that like button if you enjoyed this video. And if you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button as well. We are going for 150,000 subscribers before the Euros begin this summer in Germany. Can we do that? It's, it's a tough ask, but you never know. 5,000 more followers-ish. That would be fantastic. But, yeah, thanks again for watching. Let us know know what you think is going to win the booster tins or the mega tins and i'll see you in the next one goodbye